What's up, Vice fans? Main man, made man here. Y'all know how I get down. We talking boxing, man. Salute to the fam. Word on the curb, man. Manny Pac-Man Pacquiao will not be reinstated as the WBA super champion. Per reports. It seems as if that Manny Pacquiao put in a request back in May to be reinstated as the WBA super champion. And his request was denied. It seems as if that your Danis Ugas will continue to be the WBA super champion and go on to defend that belt. Now, I had a feeling that we would end up here, fight fans, because at the end of the day, it's much more advantageous for premier boxing champions to go on and have more than world, one world titleist at welterweight on their side. They have many names and many fighters who they would love to get into a rotation for a world title fight. So having all of these belts into one fight, well, it's great for us boxing fans, and that's something that we definitely want, undisputed. But at the end of the day, it's not as advantageous for the outfit because they got all of those fighters. Now, nothing else is pretty much changing in this fight. It's still going down in August. It's still going down at the T-Mobile Arena. The thing is, and for those who have not heard, there has been another world title, uh, well, another title, should I say, added into this fight, and that is the Ring Magazine title, which is known as the Lineal title. So this fight will be for the lineal title, but however, it will not be for all of the world, uh, uh, for the WBA Super Champions. Now, the thing is, this spells bad news for my man Tur Turns Crawford, because at the end of the day, uh, Earl Spence Jr. said that if he defeats Manny Pacquiao, he's going to go and look and see what's up with Turns Crawford. But he also now, or if it's Manny Pacquiao, they have something to negotiate against. At first, if all of those world titles would have been in that one fight, this would have gave Terrence Crawford much more leverage to ask for what he wants, given that he has the last remaining world title. But if there's going to be another world title to float around on that side, then now he they have something to negotiate against. They can tell Terrence Crawford, either you accept what we are offering you or we're going to move on and face the WBA super champion, whoever that may be. So that's just the way it works, man. And so this spells very bad news for Terrence Crawford. And uh, we'll see how that all works out. But fight fans, yeah. And on top of that, the WBA would have had a hard time getting around their own rules pertaining to the language that they got pertaining to reinstating a WBA or reinstating a champion in recess. So, I mean, it would have just been a just they would have had to go around certain rules. I'm sure they had other rules tucked away in their in their laws to say, you know, that said that they could have possibly did it or whatnot. But as far as getting around their rules and not being as advantageous to PBC to have another have all of those belts in one fight. I think at the end of the day, this is the decision that we got, man. So it is what it is, man. But it's still going to be a monumental fight. It's still going to be a huge fight. You know what I'm saying? We're going to see what happens afterwards. And uh, I don't know, man. We just want to have to see what happens afterwards with Turns Croft and see if he can still get that fight. We'll see. Thumbs up on the way out. If you didn't hit it on the way in, share, share, share. Rock those bells. I'll catch up with y'all real soon. To the next video, man. Peace out.